Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday I posted letting you know that uBlock Origin had been updated in the Microsoft Edge add-on store to uBlock Origin Lite. And as mentioned in the video, which would be linked, there was a little bit of confusion because I said this was a strange move because Microsoft hadn't clarified that it was going to be deprecating MV2 extensions like uBlock Origin. And then suddenly uBlock Origin, the original, was changed to uBlock Origin Lite and we had two uBlock Origin Lights in the Edge add-ons, one with the actual Lite logo and one still with the original uBlock Origin logo. So it caused a bit of confusion and I showed you how to get uBlock Origin back and working in Edge. The video will be linked. Now just to let you know, that this has all been one big mistake and uBlock Origin is back in the Edge add-on store and the developer of uBlock Origin, Gorehill, has confirmed that the unlisting of the uBlock Origin extension from the Edge add-on store was an accident and they have restored it. So if we just head to GitHub where the app is maintained and developed, we can see two extensions, uBlock Origin Lite in Edge extension store and if we scroll down to some of the comments here, this is where it gets interesting. 18 hours ago, I didn't do this and was not told about this. Wait, maybe I uploaded the extension to the wrong extension ID. Ugh. Okay, so it was a mistake. And if we scroll down to this section, it says... I messed up yesterday, I uploaded uBlock Lite using uBlock Origin Extension ID. So this was just pilot error, so to speak. And it said, yeah, I sent an email to someone at Extension Dev Support at Microsoft asking to roll back to original 1.65.0. Sorry about all this. So it was a mistake and an accident. And uBlock Origin is where it should be and is still in the Edge add-ons store. So... If we head to the Edge add-ons, let's do a search for uBlock. You can see that uBlock Origin comes up in the search. Yesterday it didn't. We click on uBlock Origin just to show you, and here we've got uBlock Origin Lite, and here's the original uBlock Origin once again back in the add-on store. And if we click on that, we can see Version 2025.825.0, updated August 25th, 2025. So that was yesterday in my part of the world. So it was all a mistake. And if we head back to our extensions, we can see uBlock Origin is where it should be. We can see that uBlock Origin has been installed. And here's the version I uploaded yesterday using the developer mode. So you can actually turn that off now or uninstall, remove, and you can get the so-called original uBlock Origin back from the Edge add-on store. So just wanted to post this quick video just to clear up a bit of confusion. It actually wasn't Microsoft's fault. It was the developer of uBlock Origin's fault who made a slight error. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.